Oh, you're coming to get a PS4? Alright, cool, Pixel. What's up, Scooter Boy? I'm just getting everything set up. Give me a second. Hello, CNC Games. Um, I should. Let me make sure, though. Alright, let me check here. Um... I do. It's still kind of up there in price. Um, it's normally twenty four ninety nine. It's twenty percent off though, so it's nineteen ninety nine at the moment. So, all right. Yeah, no problem. Bye. Oh, what's up, uh, Dell? Yeah, dope. I have five hundred gig ones. I have terabyte ones as well. Um, the five hundred gig ones new though are two sixty nine, so they're a little bit cheaper what's happening Dove what are you up to trying to trying to get my stream set up so sorry I'm dope I do um, let me see here you know what the, the 500 the, the used ones Used one's not that much cheaper. It's two forty nine, but uh, I'll tell you what: if you come in, I could probably like drop it down a little bit. So, um, Scooter Boy, we're in Portland, Ohio, and we have another store in Fremont, Ohio. Working back to reality, yeah, I bet you are. I, I'll. Dr it's normally, let, let me double check. Let me see what I can do on it. Hold on one second. Okay. No, Port, Port Clinton. What's up, Tattoo? Port Clinton. Like I could probably make the pre-owned one like two thirty-nine. I was just checking what it's my only one. But like like two thirty-nine, I mean that's I mean a new one's two seventy, uh two forty, that's thirty. I'd probably go two twenty you know what I could do two twenty nine dope if you want it tonight. I could do two twenty nine. GameStop sells them uh, for two fifty nine for a used five hundred. So, and it's one of the slim ones. It's one of the better ones. So, but if I go any lower than that, my business partner is gonna like yell at me. So, he's probably gonna yell at me anyway for selling it that cheap. So, because um, like, what's up, Mr. Baltimore? Good, the the good is uh, hopefully Cavs uh, finish the sweep tonight. That's what that's what's good, Mr. Baltimore. Scooter Boy, what's the address? Um, go to ccgames.net and it'll tell you the address. I really don't want to like throw it out on stream. You can look it up. It's easy to find. All right, dope. I will see you soon. up Kevin Donovan too so what's everybody playing at the moment just got got a couple games in today um, come out tomorrow technically Conan Exile haven't played it it's on Xbox one though it's nice to see an Xbox one game that came out uh, Darkest Dungeon came out on PS4. And Hyper Dimension Neptunia for VR. Don't know why it put it in their lap. I don't know. So, Delve, you're working, huh? That sucks. So do you miss California now? Did you like California that much? Work 
doesn't suck. You wouldn't. I wouldn't live there either. Like I don't know. I. It's a nice place to visit. I wouldn't live there. I, I'd tell you that too. I. I actually like it around here. I, I. I like it here a lot. So. I think I had a lot of friends that like wanted to get the hell out of like Sandusky and everything, and I. I don't. I don't get it. I actually think it's a great place to live. It does kind of suck in the winter. God, this puzzle, I remember doing this puzzle. It took me like, I could, it, my brain just couldn't figure it out. Yep, yeah, Indians tattoo. I gotta play some more God of War. I haven't played God of War in about four or five days. What's up, Bulldog? What's happening? What's new with everybody? What all what all are you guys playing? How's it going? PS4 controllers do you got? Um, actually, right now, all I got are the official ones. Um, and uh, yeah, let me show you. They are uh, $59.99 for new ones. Um, used is about $43.99. Um, kind of low on certain. Let me double check in the back. See if I can another Not at the moment. There's, usually, there's a few more colors than that. There's like red. And, um, right. There's like a gray, a silver. Um, kind of cool cleaned out of most but yeah 59.99 for new ones and 43 for used and sometimes i have off-brand ones but i'm just out at the moment but all the off-brand ones are wired they're not wireless so okay all those are wireless, wireless. yeah all right because my one's been acting up i don't know if it's the chart and the where it charges or not it's just not charging or whatever. It does, but there for a while it won't. Sometimes, gotta, like, I can, uh, um, you can get new batteries for them. They're kind of a pain in the butt to switch yeah. out. But you can get new batteries for the PS4 controllers. But it's, they wear out. And they eventually just wear out. It's nice to get a new one. Right. How far is that into the... Not very... Very... You know, like four or five hours, maybe. Okay. Game's really long. Oh, I know. I just yeah. started mine, but I just didn't. Yeah. Haven't seen that part at any of the walkthroughs that I've seen. Yeah, it's not very far. I I, I don't play like in the store like the further along ones because I don't want to like spoil too much for anybody. So yeah. All right. All right. How's it going? Good. Got some stuff you wanna trade in? All right, cool. Ooh, Xbox One. Are you looking to get something else, or? Oh uh, yeah, I'm dope. Oh, you are. Okay. Yeah. You want a PS4? I didn't know you were dope. I didn't know. Sorry. Cool. Weekly thing. Well, I'm gonna put you on camera. Say hi. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's dope, Pixel. I have no idea until I see it, but now I know who you are. Watch your face like everybody else. Thank you. There's a few people around here that watch. It's kind of funny. They come in a lot. I think you told me one other time, but I'll try to remember your face now. I am terrible at that, though, so. But I think I'll remember you from now on, too. Do you want to trade this and get the PS4? Yeah, and then I have these three controllers because I already have two more Xbox controllers. I mean, PlayStation controllers. We have so much stuff. I don't know why we have like four PlayStation 4 controllers. We're not doing this again. So this, 
Let me hear what you want. And we just went from PlayStation 4 Switch Xbox. Now we're back to PlayStation 4. I'm PS4. Now I got a PC. I know, I'm not doing it again, so I hope this is what you want. It's stressing me out. <laughs> is it, you didn't format this, did you? No, okay. I'm still in my account. Okay, I, I mean, I'm going to format it, so don't worry. It's easier for me if it's not formatted, though. Is this a 500 gig one? Yeah. Okay. Take a little bit to look up all this stuff. Okay. Hello. Hello. We're back. Oh, you're back. <laughs> Can I get down, Bobby? Yeah. I can ring you up for a I'm doing a trade, so I'll, I'll just put this on hold and I'll... Oh, no, we can wait. It's no problem. This will take a few minutes, so... Okay. It'll only take a minute to ring. Should I just leave this on the shelf? Or? No, I can, I can get it for you. You just want this? Did you want to get a system, too? Or yeah. You can get the new one? Yeah. Okay. Alright, cool. Yeah, this will just take a second to ring up. Oh, shoot. Do you say anything? What is it, the... Oh, phone. Um, I don't. Phone if you didn't put your phone number in originally, um, it, it'll be under email. Oh. Um, we just got a new. Yeah, it's your system, email. So you gotta sign in with the email if you don't have the card. Okay. It'd just be one second, guys. Don't worry, I'll go quick. $5 off. $5 off. Anything. You want to do that? Yeah, might as well use right. it, right? Hit it to <laughs> redeem. And then you go. Yay. <laughs> redeem showcase. Oh, I missed that. We got a new thing. It used to make a cha-ching sound. So <laughs> I guess it doesn't anymore. Okay. Oh, shit. Still, I'm going to have to set it up so it makes that sound. <laughs> that way I don't have to really look at it. I can yeah. hear it. So. All right, total is 348.08, and let me hit credit, and, and it'll ask you if the amount's correct here in one second. Yeah, you press the button to verify, and then just wait till it beeps, and then you can take it out. 
And I'm going to set this right here. Okay. Just need your signature there. Does this have an HD cord for? Mm -hmm. okay. It's an HDMI cord. Yep. Thanks. Yeah. The only thing that's um, not the greatest in there is the headset. They give you like little earbuds. I don't think I've ever used those. To... Yeah. I don't play anything online. Yeah, if you don't play online, it's not a big deal. All right. Thanks a lot. Thanks man. a lot. All right. Let me grab this PlayStation. All your friends on PS4 now or something? Or? Well, it's weird. Everyone moved over to Xbox and then as soon as, like, uh, um, I don't know what happened when they had everyone move over to PS4. A lot of people are doing that. I think it's mainly just there's just more games. And I think I, you should have kept the Switch. I like yeah, the Switch. Like it's my favorite. I like the Switch a lot. <laughs> and you probably hear me talk about the Switch on my stream a lot. Have you beat Far Cry 5 yet? Yes, I beat Far Cry 5. Um, actually, I streamed the whole thing. So You were just messing around in the beginning. You weren't even doing anything. I know, I wasn't. I wasn't. Then I got serious about it. So, yeah, I, I did. I beat it. I'm going to buy myself the Switch and you can't play it. Okay. Yet. I'm only like halfway through God of War. I haven't played it in a few days. I might I might stream some tonight. But I was gonna do the same thing I did with Far Cry. I'm gonna like record my whole gameplay of it. So I like the Switch though, I do. <laughs> yeah. That's sad when you try. I used to play that when you'd be at school. Yeah, I know you did. Did you play Mario? Mario. All of them. Mario is awesome. Zelda. Zelda's really good too. <laughs> I beat that without even finishing all of the shrines. Yeah, yeah, I didn't find all the shrines either. I found most of them. I wasn't going to look for all the shrines. I was only like either. halfway through the shrines and I went to the castle and did it. My Switch. The, the, I lost all my game saves though. You probably heard me talk about it. but My Switch broke. Oh, no. But it was, uh, I used, I bought a cheap third party dock for it, and that's what broke it. Oh my gosh. So, um, I had to send it back to Nintendo. I got it back, but I lost all my games. Uh, so, did so. you buy one of those ones where you didn't have to, like, set all the way in? The yeah, but it one? bought a Nyko one. Don't ever, and we, that's part of the reason we don't sell them, because they're kind of cheap and generic, but I was, I was being lazy because I streamed, but where my Switch was, my Switch was hooked up to my main TV. And, but where I stream is downstairs, and I didn't want to move the dock and everything, so I'm like, I'll just buy a dock. You know, I'll just get a cheap dock. And it, the first time I used it, it killed my Switch. Oh. And everything gone. I had to send it into Nintendo. Ugh, oh, it sucked. Yeah. And that company is getting sued big time by a lot of a lot of uh, people that it happened to. Were a bunch of companies that were making like graphics for the docks getting sued? Because like they're leaving. I I think Nintendo is because they're using they're using like their artwork and stuff like that. So um, for what you got here, it's two hundred bucks. So it comes with two hundred even. Not too bad. Um, so you could use that like I, I think, yeah it wasn't you'd have to pay a little bit. This was two twenty nine. I said I would do for you, but yeah you had two hundred in trade. Back to money. Oh, no, Mom. <laughs> My favorite game was Kingdom Hearts. They're making a new one. Are they? Yeah, it comes out. Um, I don't 
think there's an actual date yet, but they'll announce the date soon. It's this fall. Kingdom Hearts 3. It'll be on uh, PS4, Xbox One. Oh, yeah. Okay. Now I don't touch with that. Yeah. <laughs> Kingdom Hearts. I played that on DS before. That's a great game. It is. That's cool that you play. You need more women to play games. Yeah. Make fun of me. I'm so old school. I have everything downloaded on the Wii, all the older games. That's cool. <laughs> my my one daughter plays. My other daughter doesn't. My wife doesn't at all. My wife wouldn't even know how to turn them on. <laughs> um, Forty six oh nine is the difference with tax. And it'll ask you if the amount's correct here in a second. Okay. Saw that one video of that lady stealing like candies and stuff. Oh yeah, I, I I put her on the talk before going and we got her. We got some guys busted that stole some Xbox controllers too. Yeah, he like took it and I'm like put it under his shirt. Those guys were the dumbest ever. Um, the guys that stole the controllers, they uh they sold us some stuff first and we gave us their ID. So we knew exactly who they were, and then they stole. Them. <laughs> oh my god! Like people that that usually. And then you noticed them very smart. I used to own a restaurant in Sandusky, and my employees would rob rob me. Well, I will tell you, like most of the people that that I've ever caught stealing our employees, um, I've caught a few on a lot over the years. Unfortunately, um, pretty safe with the people I have here now. I, I've had them for a long time, so okay. I feel pretty comfortable, but. You just can't give people that opportunity. Yeah. I've even had some relatives steal, which uh -huh. really sucks. So, but yeah, don't steal. Be a good kid. You seem like a real good kid. Thank you. Yep, thank you. Have a good one. Have fun. Sorry, guys. I had a little run there. Sold two PS4s and got an Xbox One traded in. Yeah, I know. I know they did. I know they stole more than the Mr. K. Let me see what I missed. Oh, what's up, little French lady? I didn't see you joined. I said hi to Delve, though. I think you and Delve have, like, some little side thing going on. You guys, like, always loving on each other in, every, in each stream. I'm just joking. All right, I got to format this Xbox. That was dope pixel though, that little kid that came in. He's a pretty cool little kid. Oh, he was talking about on, on stream, we caught a lady, we caught a lady stealing candy one day and we've caught people stealing um, Xbox One controllers. Um, so there's actually some of my older videos, you can go back and look for them, but it has videos of people stealing. And, and I put them on blast on, on like, social media, and uh, it got them busted. People figured out who it was real fast. The people that stole the controllers were really dumb. Hey, you guys just heard. They traded some stuff to us for cash, and we took their ID, and we had, we had their name, and then they stole. I got that dude. Yeah, he's gone. Don't worry. He's gone. So, I, I don't know why people feel the need to come into a room and troll. Like, like what's the point? Like, I, you can just, you can boot him out real easily. He'll probably try again. I gotta format the system. Oh, I gotta check my messages here real fast too.
All right. Sorry, I'm trying to do like three things at once. Um, this stream doesn't. I just I made videos. Um, she was on the one was on stream where they were stealing candy, which wasn't a big deal. That was on stream. Um, but uh, it'd be hard to find. I don't remember exactly which day, but I do have them listed like for steel. If you they're they're older videos. I'm trying to set up too. I'm trying to I'm going back and forth with um, John from John's Arcade. Um, uh, I'm on a podcast a lot of time called Video Game Outsiders. Not a lot of times, every now and then. Um, it's a podcast they do every Tuesday night from nine to um, from nine to eleven Eastern Standard Time. If you go to Yep, dope. We were just talking about this. I am formatting your Xbox right now. Um, uh, if you go to uh, videogameoutsiders.com, they do a podcast about video games, obviously. Every Tuesday night, it's free um, to listen, and you can go in the chat room and interact. It's from 9 p.m. to 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. But they do these side ones, and only if you're um, throughout the week, they do side podcasts. Um, and if you're a member, you got you, those ones you got to pay for. Um, but I'm going to do one tonight with them so but that one's a pay one so you guys can't check it out but check out their video game outsiders.com on um on tuesday nights at 9 p.m all right back to formatting this thing reset console reset and everything Oh, yeah, that's right. I got to go online. Your PS4, uh, my PS4 may be saying overheated. I hear the fan. What does it mean? Yeah, it doesn't sound like uh, that's good. Um, I've never seen mine say that or any of them say that. Now, when I set up the wireless password for in here, I didn't I didn't set it up to make it easy when you're on a console. Uh, Urban Productions, yeah, it's safe to do that as long as you don't turn those cans of air upside down. Because if you turn them upside down, they'll spray liquid in there. Um, so don't make sure you have the can right side up. Um, I use this thing all the time. Um, I don't even know if you can still buy these, but this is a powered one. And this thing's awesome. It's got a little filter down here, but it's 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 gonna be, I'll turn it on for a second, but it's really loud. It's really powerful. This is what I use. I got them at both stores, but I, I hate buying those cans all the time. That thing saved me so much money. But we used to use cans of compressed air all the time before we got those. I don't know, you probably look for this online. It's called, uh, I don't think they were that expensive. I think it was like 15 bucks. DataVac Electric Duster, right there. But it's been, I've had this for a few years now. What's up, Paul? All right, just I gotta wait for this Xbox to reformat. Um, it's going good, straight suicidal. What's up with you? 
Uh, so I can't really see the stream except on, I can look on YouTube, but it's like 10 seconds behind. <laughs> Gibbons, no, we didn't give him a good beating. No. No, actually, we didn't. We didn't even see them steal till later. Like we saw, we went back and checked the video. I mean, the the two guys were, they were quick on stealing that. But there's cameras everywhere, so you're you're. I mean, there's cameras pretty much every corner of this place. So, and I stream a lot. Use the vacuum cleaner. How's it going? Pretty good, you? Good. If you hear me talking up here, don't think I'm nuts. I'm streaming online and. I'll just tell you you're fucking crazy. <laughs> People are asking me questions. No, I haven't, I haven't had any problems with Gears of War. Other than my only problem is I need more time to play it. Anything I can help you find, by the way? Uh, Mr. K you can you can suck it out, but it doesn't hurt to blow the dust out of them either. Um, it doesn't hurt either way. The new Need for Speed pay the, 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 yeah, the newest one out is Payback, right? Yeah. It's free right now. Is it free right now? Uh, no, is it oh. free run? Oh, oh, I haven't played it. Let me let me go double check. I thought maybe was, like is it on the um, PlayStation Plus or something for free? I thought that was what you said. Let me look. Cool. I'll just, you know what, I'll throw it to here. Is Need for Speed playback, uh, uh, payback, I'm sorry, um, free roam? Any of you guys know? I haven't played that one. Let's look it up on YouTube. I should know it, but I just don't know off the top of my head. Those look pretty badass, so like, you know This trailer's not helping me. I'll just type it in. It is, but it's not right off the bat. You have to, um, there's an update to it that makes it free roam. It's free. Um, the free roam is free. It's it's like an add-on DLC, but it's a free add-on. Okay. So that's what it says. All right, cool. Yeah. Thanks, man. Yeah, no problem.
Yeah, if you're having that many problems, I would I would uh, contact Microsoft. Their number is one eight hundred the number four and then spell my Xbox. Uh, it is. It's called Fury, Tommy. It is a girl. You actually don't have one right now. What? A 64? Uh, I have a green one. How much is it? 79. 79? Yeah. That's the only one I got. That's not bad, though. Yeah, it's a decent price. Yeah, that's not good if it keeps saying corrupted data. Right. Xbox One is formatted. Honestly, I don't know what Microsoft is doing at the moment. The more I think about it, the more it annoys me. Um, it really makes no sense that uh, that they don't have more exclusive games. Um, it, it's so bizarre. Um, I have had I, for a long time. I thought maybe maybe they're not making maybe they're not going to make another system. I've started to hear kind of rumors that there's another Xbox in the work. There's a you know a newer Xbox in the work works, um, but the way they run it, it's it's like they run it like they don't have money. But Microsoft is like the richest out of all the game companies by far. Microsoft's worth over seven hundred billion dollars, um, which is crazy. And like for example, Sony's only in like the fifty billions. Um, they're almost at sixty, and so is Nintendo. Nintendo's around sixty bill of worth. Um, and then Microsoft 700 bill. You you would think they would just make some more exclusives, like make some, take a risk. Marky Mar, we look like a computer uh, computer shop. Um, Atari, technically Atari is not. Um, the company that owns Atari is called Infogrames. Um, they own the name Atari. That's really not the same Atari that they used to be. There is an Atari, well, maybe coming out called Atari Box, but they have yet to show a, an actual working prototype of it. They always show the controller and they show um, they show the box, but as of right now, nobody's actually seen the working version of it. It really looks like a scam at the moment. It looks like a kickstart. Well, they're doing Indiegogo, which is a big sign that it might be a scam because on Indiegogo, um, you don't need to have a working prototype. If it was Kickstarter, you have to have a wor working prototype. Um, so, personally, I think the Atari box is a huge scam. It might actually come out, but it's going to suck. It's going to be terrible. <laughs> Urban. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say that. Uh, but I it just like it drives me. I actually I really like Xbox. I, I liked. Um, I I like the 360 better than PS3. Um, I just don't know what Microsoft's doing. I'm trying to figure it out like from a business perspective, and I don't get it. I don't understand. The only thing I can think of is that they. Um, I mean my in my theory, the way they're running it is, it's almost like they want to get out of the console business. Straight suicidal. There is um, publishers are more inclined just because, like, if you think about it, there's seven. They've sold over 70 million PS4s and they've sold like around 35 million Xbox Ones. So you just got a bigger, you know. There's 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 more fish in the. You're fishing in a bigger pond if you're on PS4. So you, there's more fish to catch. So if you make a game, the, the odds are your game's going to sell better on PS4. Um, not to mention, Sony invested heavily in making their own games. So, 
um, whereas Microsoft barely making any games themselves. Um, so that's really the big difference. And then, then you do have the factors like, like if it's a Japanese company, they're only going to make it for PS4 or, or Switch. The Japanese people tend to stay with their their companies tend to stay with their own um, their own systems. And uh, you know what's really funny? Like if you look at the sales numbers, um, which I do all the time, like the end of the end of April were the latest sales numbers to come in. Um, What's up, Miss Kelly? Uh, yeah, it's going to be Celtics for Skeps. Celtics are playing good. Uh, Celt- it, they, if they keep playing like that, they, they give the Cavs trouble. But back to my thing. Um, the sales numbers, for example. I looked at the sales numbers. Like, Xbox One sells great in America. It sells, it sells decent. It doesn't sell as good as PS4 or Switch. But it sells good. But in other countries, holy crap, it sells bad. Um, um, you should see the sales of Xbox One... In Japan, for example, um, like PS4, like in this is for one week. They sold like 8,000 units in Japan, okay? Uh, like Switch sold like close to 8,000 units for that week. The Vita sold like 2,000 units, which is crazy. I mean, the, the 3DS sold like a, a few thousand units. Um, the Vita sold a couple thousand units. And then there's the Xbox. The Xbox One sold 124 systems in Japan, like in a week that that's terrible like nobody even cares in japan about it you want a ps4 that's awesome dog cat yeah i don't even know why microsoft bothers even selling it in japan if i was them I wouldn't advertise it. I mean, just let people import it if they really... I'm sure those 124 people would just go and import one if they really wanted one. There's really no reason for them to even sell it in Japan if they can only move 100 100 units or so a week. I think I have the sales numbers on my desktop. Hold on. Yeah, here it is. I'll read you guys the numbers. I got it. I got it right here. Okay. So this was like the last week in, of of April. PlayStation 4. Hold on. PlayStation. This is this is um for a week. Okay. In one week, um, in North America, this is the end of April, um, PS4 sold 87,000 units. 87,000. Um, the Switch sold 66,000, and the Xbox One sold 50, 56,000. And then the 3DS sold 21,000 units. That's, that's in the America, in the U.S. Um, in Europe, uh, the PS4 actually sold better. It sold 105,000 units. Um, the Switch sold 58,000 units, and the Xbox One sold 22,000 units. So they sold half as many Xbox Ones. And then the 3DS still sold 15,000 units. Um, and then the Vita sold 293 units in Europe. In, in, in The Vita only sold 99 units in America that week. But here's where we get to Japan. Um, Japan, PS4 sold 13,000 units. Um, the Switch sold 34,000 units, so the Switch actually outsold the, the PS4. The Xbox One sold 124. Uh, the 3DS, for example, sold almost 8,000 units, and the Vita sold almost 3,000 units. So that's crazy. So, like, I'll, I'm going to add the numbers up. So the whole world that week, uh, PS4 sold 243,000 Switch sold 196,000, and the Xbox One sold 89,000. 3DS sold um, 47,000, and the Vita sold 3,500. I don't want to see any game manufacturer fail either, but man, it seems like Microsoft, for whatever reason, they're letting it fail. I'm, I, I, I sell it for a living. It's better when they all do well. It's better for me when they all do well. Trust me. I'm not rooting for um, somebody to fail. And 
and I'm not hating on Xbox, but Xbox fans always think I'm hating. I'm, I, I'm just telling the truth. It is what it is. If you like Xbox, that's great. I mean, I love Gears. Gears of War is one of my favorite games of all time. There hasn't been a Gears of War in a few years. I want Microsoft to do something. I mean, Microsoft, they have $700 billion, and they're not using it on their games division. It makes no sense to me. It makes none at all. It is time for me to close, guys. Um, I'm not going to stop streaming. Uh, I'm going to stream while I close out, so you guys can keep asking me questions, but I do got to go lock the door. So um, just give me a minute. Give you guys a quick look at the store. Robert, I don't know. I think they did all right. I kind of want a Barkley, but I, I'm okay with what they did. Straight, straight suicide. I think you're right. It makes no sense. I, I don't. If someone can explain to me what the hell Microsoft's doing, I would love to know. Uh, Mr. K, because we, after seven, this place dies. Thanks for the update, Chad. We were all wondering what you were doing right at the moment. I might stream some God. Should, should I do God of War tonight, or what should I stream? Should I do some uh, Switch, God of War, or some retro stuff? Uh, it's still pretty bright out there today. It doesn't get dark till like 8 o'clock now. You wish exclusives would be outlawed. But if, 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 if there are no exclusives, Robert, there's no point to have a console. Um, I mean, because everybody, you could just play it all on PC. Retro. Robert, you always vote for retro, I think. I mean, the reason people get consoles are for exclusives. And, well, that's not, not every reason, but that's one of, uh, um, uh, one of the major reasons. Um... No Marky Mark, but almost, um, there was a guy that robbed the store next to us and, uh, um, he got caught and when he got caught, the police told us that he was planning to rob us. Um, but we were, we were really busy at the time and he got, he got impatient. He didn't want to wait anymore. He needed money. So he robbed the store next to us. So we kind of dodged a bullet. I guess you would say they nobody got hurt or anything. Um, so literally dodged a bullet. But we are packing here and our other store is, so it might have got interesting if somebody came in with a gun. They might not have left. Or I might not have left. Or but it would have probably got interesting.
One second. Oh. Um, and it's funny. It's not there anymore. It was. It, it was. Um, it's. It's went through a couple things. It. It was surprisingly. Sounds kind of weird, but it was like. Uh, it had like fabric and sewing and stuff. It was kind of. It was an old lady. I feel. Feel bad for. Her, um, feel bad for her that she got robbed. Um, she doesn't have a lot of money on hand either, so I'm sure that it wasn't worth it. Um, but uh, yeah, it, it was a sewing place. Um, but that place was gone, and then we had a Sprint store, and now it's empty again. Um, for whatever reason, the store next to us just can't stay in business. So they wanted to rob us, but they got impatient, Robert. Guns in the store are not mental. I really don't want to get into a gun debate. Anybody, you know what's funny though, haters? Anybody that thinks um, because you can shoot in a game that you'd be a good shot in real, that is the most asinine like argument ever. And I've, I've heard that on gun debates that, oh, they played Call of Duty all the time. They trained on Call of Duty or something like that. It's so dumb, it's not even funny. Because if you've ever shot an actual gun, it's not any remotely close to any uh, arcade gun or, or playing Call of Duty or anything like that. It's complete and utter bullshit to think that um, you, can, you can play a video game and learn to shoot a gun. I, I I could I could probably in House of the Dead I could probably shoot the booger out of a out of a zombie's nose. That's how good I am. I'm not that good at shooting a gun, a real gun. It's so much harder to shoot a real gun. Well, not only that, if you ever get in a if you ever get in a real gun fight, just jump and strafe, and you'll be all right. Just jump around like a jackrabbit and strafe, and nobody will be able to hit you. If you if you aim off the screen too, you reload. If you just, you know, it reloads automatically. Video games aren't dangerous. Grand Theft Auto. Yeah, because there was there was never any any gun violence before video games because guns didn't exist before video games. Because the Wild West, they didn't shoot people all the time. I know you're being funny, Robert. Video, yeah, video games do all that. They make they they make people do all that stuff. Um, the Gores. Um, Hillary Clinton tried to uh, tried to ban video games. Even honestly, even Trump. Trump has had some stupid comments about video games uh, recently. Um, it's it's all unfortunately most of the people. Uh, it's, it doesn't matter, Democrat, Republican, all the all the older people that are running our country, they have no idea about technology. It, it's I mean, it's the same thing they did back in the 60s when they said music was causing all the problems. They just, it, it's what old people don't understand. They, they blame whatever they don't understand.
I can't wait for the new Red Dead JA. Um, you know, I'm kind of weird. I like turtles too. I'm kind of weird. I didn't. I didn't actually realize until recently. Um, for for you, that it's so funny to me. Like like Trump had any idea what they were talking about. Trump. Trump Trump's like your grandpa that refers to like everything. Um, he talks in general, in general speak. So that's why he gets called a liar all the time too. And he, he does lie, but he talks like, like when he, for example, this is about as political as it gets. When he says he wiretapped, they technically didn't wiretap him, but they surveilled him. To, to, he's like the guy that calls he calls all video games Nintendo, like when your grandparents call. All video games, Nintendo, everything's a Nintendo to them. You can't be that way as a politician. You've got to be very specific or people will jump down your throat. Uh, there were already a few video games about him where you could kill him, which is really, really, really bad. There was one I think Rosie O'Donnell tweeted out where you could push him off a cliff. Well, it's swords and knives and I don't think it exists anymore, Robert. That was like when he first when he first won. I'm pretty sure you can't do it anymore. Um, my dad's Jeff Jeff Dahmer. Awesome. Uh I would say it's the second best game because God of War is better. In my opinion. You can disagree with me, but I, I beat Far Cry. I'm halfway through God of War. I think God of War is better, but they're kind of different types of games. So I guess it depends what you're in the mood for. Well, we know where Robert stands. <laughs> All right, let's stop. Um, Far Cry 4 was better than 5. I actually like Primal a lot, too. Uh, but I do got to get out of here because I got to do the one podcast tonight. So um, I got to do a podcast with a guy. Um, so I will check you guys out later. I'll probably stream some God of War later tonight, probably like 1030 or... So, 10.30-ish. Uh, sorry to hear that, Robert. Sorry. Sorry about your luck, buddy. I'm just joking. All right, I got to run, though. I will see you guys later. <clears throat> Goodbye. You don't have to go home, but you can't stay here.